OK, so let's say we want to differentiate y equals x cubed from first principles. Now, we're expecting that the result should be 3x squared, right? So let's show that to be the case. So dy by dx is going to be equal to the limit as h tends to 0 of f of x plus h. Now, f of x in this case is the x cubed. f of x plus h is x plus h cubed. OK, so this is x plus h cubed. Take away f of x, so x cubed, all over h. Now, we need to expand those brackets, OK? Now, in doing that, because you expand x plus h times x plus h, get that, then multiply that by x plus h, um, you can multiply it out like so. Um, but if you've done some binomial already, OK, binomial expansion, you may be able to do that already. So let's say we've multiplied it all out. We should be able to get x cubed plus 3hx squared plus 3h squared x plus h cubed. That will be the result once you multiply everything out and collect it like terms. OK, if you're not happy about going from there to there like so, then I would multiply it out bracket by bracket just to check. Then we're taking away x cubed on the end. So clearly that will cancel with that. So leaving us with 3hx squared, rather, plus 3h squared x plus h cubed, all over h. Now these have a common factor of h, so I can cancel through. So we get 3x squared plus 3hx plus h squared. Now, as h tends to 0, this h will get smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller. And so this term will tend to 0 as well. And this term will definitely tend to 0 even faster because h squared. So both of those two terms differentiate, well, sorry, tend to 0, leaving us with the 3x squared as we expected.